Hello everyone, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create the new timeout thing that just came out a couple of days ago. And before we start the video, I would like to tell you Happy New Year and sorry for not uploading for too long. But I was actually minding my own business, I had stuff to do, studies and lots of problems. Anyways, hope you're all doing great. So without further ado, let's hop into the video. Right, so uh, I'm actually next week making a fifty dollar uh, euro actually uh, giveaway, not giveaway, like an event. So you probably wanna join the server. And right now, or not right now, <laughs> after 40 minutes, I'll be doing a last to review see it's Nitro. I'm just trying to revive the server a little bit and uh, the channel because I haven't uploaded it in a while. So let's actually start coding this. So first of all, let's actually create uh, the command. And for your information, I haven't coded in a really, really, really long time, months. So, uh, since this is a new update in Discord.js, so I guess we're gonna be, like, let me just go here, show it to you. Discord.js, announcement here, taking a while to load. Alright, here we go. So this is the timeout thingy, it basically uh, blocks people from chatting and joining VCs, so that's like a mute, and um, temporary one. So, uh, we need to update our Discord.js version, so we will do like that, npmi Discord.js at latest. And yeah, now let's actually make it let's call it timeout all right and you can also call it mute this is like it's legit a mute command and not a timeout you know what i mean so uh description mutes uh member for a certain amount of time all right, and I'm also using a new mic. Hopefully, it's better. So there will be three options, which is time, member, and uh, reason. Let's put the name uh, of this one: member. Description: the selected member. Type there is a member or I'm not quite sure if there is a member type, so I'm going to use user and required will be true. All right, let's make another one name uh, time description time. Uh, for the timeout. I'm not even sure if that makes sense, but like, you understand what I mean? Like, uh, or let's say, uh, the time that person or member will be muted. That makes more sense, I guess. Type is going to be string and required. True, of course. All right, last one here is reason, and we need reason because it shows in the audit log, so here we go. You can just put no reason by default, but let's keep it with a reason actually. All right, here we are, so the type is going to be string, okay, oops, there. 
require this true all right so i guess it should be created let me try to run it real quick to check let me go here uh, slash timeout yep it's here so this is my package let's make a quick update so i can buy contracts this is not required by the way i'm just installing the latest one so it doesn't show this anyways so now uh let's go to slash commands let's go to moderation let's add a new one call it timeout.js here we go slash command here we are so we're gonna need to install something called ms so npm i ms let's here do const uh, ms equal require uh, ms basically all right so the name of the command is timeout and let's get to work so let uh, number equal uh, interaction dot uh, options dot get get user all right and let me actually do it like this like uh, you know what let's keep it like that for now I put here member so I'm gonna do something and then I'm gonna put, put here dot ID and I'm gonna do here uh, interaction dot guild dot cache dot members or it's like dot members dot cache I guess dot get I haven't coded in a while alright so that's how I fetch the member from the guild let's now get the time so equal oh so let's put here ms and put here the time basically which is interaction and i'm also a bit sick that's why i'm doing huh, a lot i don't know gasping or whatever it's called uh, interaction dot get or dot options dot get string which is time and let uh, reason equal interaction dot options dot get string reason so basically here i'm getting the member as here it's getting as a user so what i'm going to do is go get it from the guild and fetch it as a member now and here the time i put it in ms so it transforms the time so if the person put one day or put one d here this ms will make it turn into ms basically okay so uh here lastly is the reason so now we can actually just do member dot timeout uh here's a member the time well let me check here real quick because i forgot uh the way we actually put that so timeout uh, time out and then the reason okay so basically time and reason all right I guess it's like that I'm not sure because I haven't done that yet but let's give it a try so let me log in into my alt account real quick all right, so here I am into my alt account finally after a while. So let me just adjust this. Okay, got it, got it. 
Got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay. So here I'm able to send stuff and I'm able to get into voice channels, which is good. Okay. Now let me try to time out myself. My alt basically, weirdo. Let's put it as one minute. And the reason is testing. And no error. Oh yeah, I forgot to actually reply to it, but I actually got timed out here. As you can see, I can't even join anything, which is uh, good. But now, since I didn't put any thing here, let me let me actually do one more thing. It's check the time because someone can answer it a invalid time. So let me put if. No time, so I want to interaction not reply. Please provide a valid time. All right, and if it works, I just want to interaction not reply. Uh, successfully muted. Uh, Remember, okay, for the X amount of time, so let's put here, and that's it. Alright, or we don't actually have to put the time since it's an MS. Alright, here we go, let's give it one more t try here. Uh, I'll just no thank you. Sending, sending, sending. Slash timeout. Number weirdo time. Ten seconds. Reason. Subscribe. And here we are. I um, can't send or do anything here now. So that basically works, which is good. Like. Yeah, I haven't quoted in a while so, like, while, so I feel kinda happy for making something working now. Anyways, uh, of course it's it's working and I know what I'm doing, uh, and uh, have a new year, that's what it for today's video, hope you enjoyed, don't forget to like and to subscribe, and leave a comment down below what you want the next video to be, that's it, and ciao.